Hi, this is Bukhari from Bukhari Works. Today I'm going to show you how to install Flex Slider 2 in a very easy way. Within few steps, you'll be creating a great image slider using Flex Slider. So before we start, we need to get this downloaded. This is the flexslider.bootems.com site, original site, and we're going to download this Flex Slider. Clicking in here, it will be starting to download immediately. Press save. It is downloading. Uh, depending on the internet speed, it is downloading. And now that it has been downloaded, I'm gonna click to unzip it. I'm gonna minimize this window. This is the download folder this is the first thing you do download the flex slider files in your file computer next thing you do is that I'm going to create a folder on my desktop this is my desktop and this is the download folder this is download folder and this is the desktop right so now I'm creating a folder called flex slider you can name it by your choice and within this folder I'm going to create three more folders one is called CSS other one is called JS and the last one will be calling images okay uh, this is my desktop folder please be informed this is my desktop desktop and within the desktop on on my desktop I'm going I've created a folder called flex slider 2 and within this folder I'm I have created three more folders called CSS JS and images and from the download folder I'm going to copy flex slider dot CSS by pressing command C on Mac and coming back to my flex ladder desktop folder in this CSS folder I'm going to paste it command V and jquery dot flex ladder dot js by selecting it I'm going to press command C copy it, and I'm going to paste it in my flex ladder folder in the js folder command V paste okay um, and from this download folder in the image folder I'm going to copy this image PNG controller navigation PNG file come and see and in my folder in the image folder I'm going to paste it by command pressing command V and I'm going to copy other images that I want to show in my image slider and I'm going to copy five images from there and I'm going to paste it in my image folder so this is the first step you do download the flex slider second thing you do is that make the folder and within this folder you create three folders called CSS images JS JS JavaScript file and first thing second thing third thing is by going to demo folder and open this index file in the dreamweaver cs6 that is because we are going to copy some codes from there and paste in our file so uh, now that i have opened the index file html file from the flex ladder 2 original one I'm going to create a new file create I'm gonna give it a title within this body in the coming back to index.html I'm going to copy this line of codes it's 12 o'clock this section verb from line 48 to 65 section opening section closing section 
this section for command C coming back to our file we haven't saved it yet we're gonna save it save as desktop flex slider within this flex slider folder we're gonna save it calling it flex slider 2 save and I'm going to change the images by selecting this part of line by pressing in this folder icon I have my images in the right place and now I'm going to copy this line of code I'm going to remove this and I'm going to copy this line of code command C and paste it five times twice and I'm simply going to change the number in there because I have saved my images like that to make things easy so now that I have my images stacking on top of each other um, I'm going to add the add the jQuery functionality by going back to index.html file I'm going to copy this line of code from here command C coming back to my flex slider 2.html file and paste it within the body and I am going to add the CSS code from here as well and this is the line of code we need only because flex slider.css this is what we need come and see coming back to our file paste and we are going to remove these dots because we need to specify our root folder where this file is located flexlider.css remember we have put the flexlider.css file in the CSS folder and the JavaScript file same thing applies removing, removing these dots and we're going to give it the root folder where we put the jQuery.flexlider.js we put we kept it in JS folder <coughs> and um, gentlemen this is done so now I press the live button you'll be seeing the fully functional jQuery um, flexlider2 image slider by pressing in here you have the great fully functional great looking image slider flex slider 2 and it is fully resp responsive and um, one thing we will not be seeing the arrow in here because we need to, to, to see that we need to go to the flex slider dot CSS in line number 53 I guess um, in here you come in here in the in here it is in the image folder images folder and we to sh make it visible we need to put two dots and backslash and I right click on it save all go back to source code and it is there so far so good and it is complete gentlemen this is your super cool super easy super fast super convenient flex slider 2 now we're going to see it in the, the safari there you go this is our beautiful fully functional complete flex slider 2 image slider this is amazing i found it very very easy you just have to simply copy and paste that's it 
it is super fast, super cool, super easy. So hopefully it helps you guys and um, maybe you will be using it in your projects and uh, please do share with others if it if it helps you if it comes in handy and uh, so there it is so take care bye enjoy